Hello everyone, in this video I am going to be taking a look at the legendary Pokemon 12 inch figures. These toys were sent to me by Character Options, please look in the description for more information. There are three figures available in this size. Lunala, Solgaleo and Necrozma. These are articulated figures as well so let's get them out of the box and have a look. I got them out of the box and they were a little bit tricky so you might need a bit of help and don't get carried away throwing the packaging straight in the bin because Lunala and Necrozma do have stands hidden away in there as well. So to start as it's in my hand we have Necrozma. Necrozma has I believe four points of articulation. We have both arms. Starting off with Necrozma we have four points of articulation. Both the arms a little bit top heavy so they do stay up but not for long but that's to be expected with a figure of this type. We also have some articulation in the legs as well. It is a little bit of a pointy Pokemon, but the edges aren't that sharp. They, like these ones here are made of a soft-ish plastic, so they shouldn't be doing any damage. There's a nice little bit of detail there on the back as well. To put Necrozma on his stand, there is a little hook in the back and then he stands up like so. Next we have Lunala. Now as expected, Lunala has flappy flappy wings. You can also move Lunala's head. And just like Necrozma, it too has a stand and you just place it in the back like so. And also shout out to the attention to detail on Lunala's stand which is a nice little moon shape. Finally we have a Solgaleo and this one has got a little bit of weight to it. As expected all the legs move so you can pose it in many many ways. Maybe even a handstand. Yay Solgaleo doing a handstand. And it can also move its neck around as well. The tail moves as well, which is a bendy plastic, so that won't snap off in general play. So those are the three legendary Pokemon figures. Let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite. Personally, I really like the Solgaleo one. I was not much of a Solgaleo fan, but this one's really, really cute. Again, a massive thank you to Character Options for sending me out these toys to show you guys. And I will see you guys in the next video.